We gather here today to celebrate Kyle and Kara as they come together to unite in holy matrimony. I can't explain how honored and elated I am to get the privilege of wedding two friends who I hold so much love and respect for. I got to watch you grow up and head off to SFA and I hear from mom and mom says, hey, you know, Kara's met a guy. That's, you know, she really likes him. He's at Texas A&M. And I'm like, that is a long way away. That's five hours or something like that. Shouldn't she be studying? <laughs> but as a dad, all you can hope for is your daughter to be happy and for her to find a guy who's just a really solid, good guy. I think we can all agree that you look beautiful. Carol, you look amazing as well. <laughs> I can confidently say Kyle is a hardworking, patient, and kind man. And he also has the ability to hold a 30 minute conversation with a brick wall. I couldn't ask for anyone better for Kara. I know that you will treat her right and be the most loving husband. I love you both so much and I'm so grateful to be a part of this special day and journey that is to be the rest of your lives. Kyle, as for you, man, I could stand up here all night tell stories over the past 20 years, some of them inappropriate, so I won't, of what makes you such a great guy. But basically everybody here that's met you already knows how, how great of a guy you are, and mostly because they're gonna know your whole life story the first time they talk to you. Hey. <laughs> You're gonna make me cry. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> You look so beautiful. I'm so proud of you. Do you like it? Oh yeah, my lovely dress. I love you. I love you. Kyle and Kara, as you embark upon this journey together, embrace all that life throws your way. Relish opportunities to spend time with one another, learn from one another, and embrace one another. Accept your mistakes and find areas of compromise when you disagree. Sow seeds of trust and respect today and reap the benefits down the line. Remember to lean on each other. Always keep your spouse at the center of your heart and be ever ready to provide them support. It's always going to be hard to believe, but if you're able to do these things, you'll be even more in love with each other in the years to come than you are right now. Kara. You come from a fantastic family, even though your dad cheers for UT. Uh, we're not going to talk about that. Uh, the Warrens, that's like a second family to me. Y'all have always accepted me and my family. And if I ever need someone, y'all are going to be the people that watch my kids when it comes down to it. So I love you, buddy. And I care. I'm proud of you for marrying my best friend. Congratulations. Mark chapter 10 verse 9 says, Therefore what God has joined together, let man not separate. And with that, by the power bestowed on me by the state of Texas, 
I now pronounce you husband and wife. Kyle, you may kiss your bride. <laughs>